Week 8 Maths Dividing Fractions First, check you have found and read these downloadable lesson notes, shown here and found in Week 8. They cover adding and subtracting fractions, but also dividing fractions, which we're going to cover in this video. So let's turn past the adding and subtracting onto dividing, and we're going to focus on this worked example here and the explanation that goes with it underneath. So let's have a look at that sum shown here. Let's just pop that back. So the sum is three quarters divided by four fifths. Now to divide a fraction, we first have to change the sum. And we do that by turning the second fraction upside down and then changing the divide to a multiply. Then we rewrite our sum. The first fraction stays the same. Then we have our multiply. And then remember the second fraction has turned upside down. So it's now five quarters. Now we can multiply our fractions. Remember, we times the numerators by each other and then we times the denominators by each other. 3 times 5 is 15. 4 times 4 is 16. The answer is 15 sixteenths. And the next stage would be to simplify that fraction. To do that, we would have to find one common number that we could divide 15 and 16 by. We don't have one. This fraction is in its simplest form already. So that is our final answer.